My dear brothers and sisters, my dear friends, my dear devotees of our Blessed Mother Perpetual Help at Novena Church, Singapore, the church dedicated to St. Alphonsus Maria de Ligori. I'd like to reflect with you today on the life and spirituality of the founder of the Redemptorist Congregation, the Congregation of the Most Holy Redeemer, St. Alphonsus Maria de Liguori. St. Alphonsus Maria de Liguori was born in 1696 in a noble family in southern Italy, the city of Naples. As a young boy, he received the best education life could offer. All the teachers in every walk of life and field of education were brought to his home to train him in music, in composition, in art, in astronomy, reading the stars, in the classics, Greek and Latin, history and geography, name it. He studied it and excelled. As a young man, he soon embraced the life of law and began to practice not criminal law, but civil law, specializing in property matters. He was a very successful lawyer until on a particular case, sure to win the case because he had all the arguments only to find that the judge deciding the case was bribed by the opponents and the judge ruled in favor of the opponents. Alphonsus was distraught. He couldn't believe that he lost a case because of treachery, bribery, deceit and dishonesty. He decided to give up the legal profession and he embraced the way of the priesthood. 